Hi there, it's Matoro's Nursery, and we're going to be working on the baby skin. So, you're going to take a mop brush, and I already put in a little bit of the um, odorless thinner. I just made it to a consistency where, um, I don't know if you could see it, but um, I'll, I'll bring it closer. Um, as you can see, the consistency is very thin, and this is the baby skin. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to take a little bit out of the baby skin. And we're gonna put it in here. And we're, where's the thing over here? Okay, we're gonna put it in here and, and move it around. Make sure that when you're doing this, that you're doing a milky consistency. And what you want to do is you don't want it to be like you don't want it to be like like you don't want like a lot of um what's that word? You don't want like a lot of clumps. You want it to be not clumpy. And then you're just going to get a, um, the cosmetic sponges. And I have, hold on a minute. Uh, I have the cosmetic sponges. You got a whole bag of cosmetic sponges. You go and you take one out. You got to take one out. Go like this. And you're just going to go like this and even it out. And then you're going to take the head and you're going to go like this. And you're just going to pounce it all over. Make sure that it's even. Make sure that you have enough. You know, if you need to go for more, then you go back for more. If you see the kit getting wet, that means that you have a, you know, that means that you have it. It means that it's getting to be baby skin. And then after you're done with this, then you're going to go and you're going to bake it. bake it after you're done I want to do the whole I want to do the whole body and then I'm gonna bake it each by each yep and then you're just gonna bake it yeah if you see a little bit of like dirt because we live on Long Island so Long Island is a dirty dirty place <laughs> unfortunately it's the truth we have a lot of dirt and a lot of you know there's like a lot of dirt here it's like crazy there's a lot of dirt and remember, because this has some air dry on it, it's not going to be as perfect as if it didn't have any air dry on it, unfortunately. But it's okay. I mean, hopefully the mottling will cover it up. I think it will. All right, so now I'm going to do the legs. All right, so same thing for the legs. You're going to take the mop brush, and you're going to go like this onto the, onto the, um, Spot, uh, spot, uh, cosmetic sponge, and you're just gonna go like this. Make sure it's not chalky. Make sure the consistency is a milk-ish thing, and make sure that you don't want to put a lot of layers on. You don't want to overlayer it. I would just do. Um, an artist told me to just do like three, four layers. She said not to do a lot of layers. She said make sure you don't like overlayer, and then you're gonna use the mottling. You know, you're gonna use the mottling, and you're gonna use the um, there's a lot of stuff that you're going to use. So, you know, the layers are going to be, you know, the, basically the first part of this, this is going to be the layers first part. Okay. I'm running out of like, I'm running out of it, but I don't think I am. I think I'm okay for now. Yeah, I think I'm okay for now. You know, if you see any dirt, you're just going to wipe it off. If you need more, you just go and you, and you, you know, keep on, keep on, like, you know, you, you want to pounce. You don't want to smooth it on. You're pouncing it. So you're going to pounce it. I think I could go back. I think I could use, I think I could go and, and start doing the, the air dry again, because I think I finally got the whole consistency. I think I did. I think that I did, but like, I'm going to do half air dry and half Genesis. Cause I really like the Genesis. I think it's a very pretty color you know genesis is nice you know it's really nice i like genesis and i also like the you know i like the i like genesis and i also like the um what's it called uh you know a little bit of stuff goes a long way you don't need a lot of like you do you really don't you don't need a lot you know and you want to make sure that you don't warp your kit so you can't put it in too long because then you're going to warp your kit and you don't want that you know, it should go on 
like, you know, it should be, you know, it should go on and it should be fine. I mean, I think that, you know, it's very important to just keep on, you know, going and don't give up, you know. This is very important, you know. And now I've gone for five minutes, so we're going to I'm going to end this because now you're going to put it in the oven, in the halogen oven. I I don't know if you need to to like see it going. If you need to see it going, I'll I'll put it on for you if you want to see it going. All right, I'll do that in the next video. Okay, bye.